to conduct the cyclone maneuver about 20 meters off the surface. At NASA's Mission Control, the final tense moments of a seven-month, 470 million kilometer journey. We've lost direct to Earth tones. Would the space agency's Perseverance okay, rover okay. land safely on Mars, a goal which has eluded so many others before? And then at 8.55 this evening, the moment of truth. Touchdown confirmed. Perseverance safely on the surface of Mars, ready to begin seeking the sands of past life. The joy and relief clear to see, and then the rover's first images from the surface of Mars. This happened just seconds ago, just arrived, and uh, this is really amazing. So you can see the wheels there, uh, and, 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 the, and they're a little dirty because you've got uh, glass covers over these, these cameras, but uh, we took these seconds after landing, so, so there's still dust in the air from our landing event. Around the world, scientists watched with delight. <laughs> People had to build it to withstand the ridiculous temperature that it got to, like thousands of degrees falling through the atmosphere. But then also, you know, someone's had to write the computer code to tell it to like deploy the parachute at this time and then automatically figure out how to adjust your course to land in the right place. They called the entry the seven minutes of terror due to the daunting technical challenges. The capsule had to decelerate through the ultra thin Martian atmosphere. Then the rover lowered onto the surface using tethers, a system known as Sky Crane. And then the landing in the Jezero crater to set about searching for signs of ancient life. <laughs> Celebrations at NASA with tonight's dramatic touchdown as perseverance pays off with Mars and its secrets firmly in everyone's sights. Neil Connery, News at 10.